Yeah. I mean, big time uh, reaction and uh, one, one, one in the series against Algeris. What did you do differently today and you won the games? Uh, we just played with a lot more energy and uh, we played a lot more aggressive than we did the first game. And uh, uh, it really showed today how we were connected as a team, both offensively and defensively. The, one of the questions for your team was your defense down the stretch. Uh, you stopped that game for scoring in the fourth quarter for plenty of minutes. What do you think about uh, this last quarter? Yeah, uh, especially uh, that third quarter, we kind of got caught moving slow and they scored a lot, but uh, we got our feet back underneath us in the fourth quarter and we tightened up and we just played physical until uh, we got to the bonus. And um, yeah, that's how we have to attack them. We can't let them play comfortable. They have too many plays, too many sets. And they run it very well, so we have to try to disrupt them any way we can. You stepped up big time in the absence of Nikola Milutinov. 21 points, big plays on both heads, lots of energy. What do you have to say about your own performance? Uh, the game winning performance. I got lucky. You know, the ball was bouncing my way, but uh, you know, it's big pressure, uh, especially these games without Nico, that everyone has to step up and uh, fill that void. And uh, just happy that the team did a good job today and focused in and uh, played hard. And especially at the first half, uh, you stopped uh, Brandon Dave, you were amazed. How did you do that? Uh, we knew we had to get him in foul trouble and attack him immediately uh, in the post and on the drives to slow him down, try to get him mentally out of the game, uh, which worked well. Unfortunately, we couldn't do it in the second half and he got going a little bit, but uh, I think the approach to the game was the right way and we have to continue to uh, try to take their key players out. And two of your teammates, uh, teammates played with uh, self-sacrifices, basically, in that game, Papa Nicolau and Pogris. Uh, they haven't recovered uh, from injuries, but they insisted on stepping up. So what do you think about the inspiration these players give to you? Well, uh, there's really no words for that. Uh, I mean, for them to do that, sacrifice their bodies when they're not 100% for the team, for the playoffs, it's something uh, you just can't explain, uh, but everyone appreciated it. And uh, not only did they play, they played hard. They played well, and they, uh, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just happy to be a part of something like that, where guys are willing to sacrifice themselves during a crucial time like this. But with all these injured guys, 